this is Havoc with the HGC Gaming Channel. Today I am going to show you how to raise the max player level cap in Ark Survival Evolved. So let's just get right down to it. So this you're going to find in the description found below this video. And you're going to need to copy and paste this into your game.ini file. And if you don't know what that is or where to find it, don't worry. I'm going to show you how to do that as well. Uh, but first, I just kind of want to give you a quick idea of what this stuff means. So these three lines are kind of self-explanatory. Override max experience points for the player and for the dino. Um, you don't have to concern yourself with that too much. Uh, just copy and paste it. You'll be fine. Um, but right here, you can look at this as more of a template. This tells the game at what level do you need X amount of experience points to reach the next level, if that makes sense. So just real quick, experience points for level zero equals five. So you need five experience points to be level zero, I guess. Um, experience points for level one, you need 10 experience points. And then once you get down here, let's see what the last level is. Uh, experience points for level 498. What is that? About 32 million. 31,904,406. So you can actually add more levels on top of that, I believe. Um, but this is what I've got. So um, you can just copy and paste this into your game.ini file, and I think you'll be pretty happy with it. Um, so I'll show you where to put this. We're going to copy it. All right. Cool. So go to your file explorer. Go to your C drive, program files by 86, Steam, Steam apps, common, arc, shooter game, save, config, Windows no editor. Here are your .ini files. Now the two main .ini files that you'll use in arc to kind of change around options and you know uh, change around some of the more advanced options, um, it's gonna be this one and this one. Here's your game.ini file, and here's your game user settings.ini file. Today we're going to be using the game.ini file. So this is what it's going to look like. And real quick note, where is it? Right here. Allow unlimited respects. Usually that says equals false. By default, that says false. So if you change that to true, you can then do multiple mind wipes within the same level. So if you're at level 100 and you're stuck with all your points put into crafting skill or something like that, um, or if you just don't want to be stuck with only one mind wipe per level, uh, just set that to true and save it. Um, so that aside, let's go down here and add this line of code. Okay, so we're going to save that. And then we're gonna go ahead and test that by actually starting a new game and uh, giving ourselves experience points with uh, admin code just to see what level we can get up to. Now, just kind of a quick backstory. I was playing on my server, I reached level 100, and I was under the threat of only having one mind wipe left. Now, I think theoretically I can copy that unlimited respect code and put that into my server's game.ini file and be okay, theoretically. Now, when I did this on my server, when I got into the game, I uh, had leveled up 94 extra levels up to level 194 because once I reached level 100, I did a bunch of stuff. And I was backlogging that experience point, uh, all those experience points. And even though I wasn't getting levels for them, the game still recognized that I earned those experience points. Um, so now I'm at level 194. Now the theoretically, again, this should work on your single player file. I cannot test it and verify it 100% without naturally reaching level 100 in single player and you know, going up to level 101. That's the only true way to test this. Theoretically, it should work. So if you're at level 100 and you're watching this video, please let me know if this works for you. 
please put it in the comment section below. If it doesn't work, please put it in the comment section below. And uh, I'll take the video down and uh, do more research. But again, I did all the same stuff just on my server and it worked. So hopefully this works for you as well. So you, today you guys are kind of my guinea pigs. Usually I like to verify, but I don't have a single player file right now. And the only concrete way that I could think of to test this to make sure that worked before I put it up on YouTube would be to play single player and then reach level 101, which I mean, that's, what is that, 15 hours? Something like that. So, all right, here we go. We're just gonna bust right through. We're not gonna make the character or anything. We're just gonna wake this guy up and put in the admin code for ad experience and make sure it works. Create new survivor, create new survivor, accept. All right, so. Add experience. Let's just say nine 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 one dash one. This is how you give yourself experience points, by the way. Okay, hit enter. So level four hundred and seventy. Like, so I don't know why this doesn't actually bring me up to what was it, level four ninety eight, like it says in the code. Something weird about it. I don't know, but you know, if you're stuck at level one hundred. Uh, 469 should be a pretty big improvement um, but yeah that's all there is to it I hope that this video helped you out and again please let me know uh, you know especially if you're at level 100 and you need to figure out a way to get to level 101 um, this should do it so thanks for watching and if you have any suggestions for any other videos that I can maybe try to be helpful with please put that in the comment section below because then I know uh, uh, what there is for demand for um, tutorial videos. Thank you very much for watching and we'll see you next time.